Um, actually, <clears throat> hi guys, it's Hannah Mojo. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to. <laughs> Is that how Jeffrey started it? Welcome back to my channel. Hello, everyone. Today's video is going to be a roller coaster. Strap in. <laughs> so, I bought all of these eyeshadow palettes, unironically, in support of these YouTubers and influencers and makeup artists and entrepreneurs during better times. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, Jeffrey's still thriving. I'm sure they're all, Jacqueline's thriving. They're all still thriving in their own ways. I kind of bought them with the idea of doing this video, but then as things got messier and messier, this video became way more interesting and I was way more excited I to film it. And I mean like what the fuck do you want me to do with these palettes in a perfect world? Like do you want me to like Jake Paul team 10 like burn them? Like no I already bought them. I already spent my money on them. I might as well make some content out of it and then I don't know. Tell me whose palette I should throw away after this in the comments below. <laughs> Today in front of me I have Manny MUA's Lunar Beauty palette, Jeffree Star's Blood Sugar palette, Jaclyn Hill's um Revoked? Is that a good word? <laughs> uh, Morphe vault thing. Laura Lee's like weird party city palette. The original Jaclyn Hill palette. Basically, I want to take all of these palettes and try to make one cohesive eye look out of them. <laughs> now that I'm like, like all day, I've been walking around like, this is such a good video idea. Like, mm -hmm, I'm a YouTuber. Like, I thought of this. Like, no one's ever done it. And I'm sitting down to film it now and I'm like saying this out loud and I'm like, this idea is so fucking stupid. Like, no wonder no one has done it. <laughs> Every makeup video I've ever done where I like try a look is like clearly a joke I don't ever like try to like execute like a good ass look like I'm always just like eh fuck it like halfway through because like I'm untalented And so today I want to try to do like a wearable But by wearable I also mean like rainbow because there's like so many colors <laughs> I'm just going for like a wearable rainbow eye. Like you can wear it to church and like, I don't know I really I did the first half of my makeup and now I'm gonna put all of these eyeshadows on my eye. Maybe not all of them, just some from each palette, you know? Because the only place that all of these YouTubers will ever live in harmony is on my face today. Get it? Because they all fucking hate each other. <laughs> yeah, I really wish I had some Sishar shadow to use today, but I do not. But, you know, Morphe codes, use code James. Lord, Laura, or Manny, or, you know, Shane, or Jake Paul, or whatever. And I think that it's like Sishar spooky Shijin. <laughs> Uh, I want to go for something like rainbow and like bold and I want to cut my crease But you saw what happened last time I cut my crease like <laughs> I just don't think I meant to know how to cut my crease in this life So out of all of these people, I think right now Jeffree Star is probably the least problematic So we'll, we'll start with him. I'm Tana by the way <laughs> Welcome to my channel. You can subscribe. I'm wearing my merch right now for fuck up. You can't really tell. It just looks like a black shirt, but I'm wearing it and it's linked below. Um, if you live in the Dominican Republic, I will be performing at a music festival near you in Punta Cana on the 11th. You should come. That's what YouTubers do, right? They promote themselves. Dude, not to just like put Jeffrey's dick in my mouth like everyone else, but all of these palettes are like very, they're nice, they're good, they're cool, they're fresh, they're fun, whatever. But like this is a whole ass like trunk. Like this is a whole ass like suitcase and it's like leather and like, and for it to be cruelty free and like pigmented and like not that expensive and like just go off. Like the most I will ever release is like a mediocre phone case and Jeffrey's is out here releasing like trunks of pigmented shadow like okay there's a hot pink shade and i literally thought it said cunt but it just says cavity oh my god they're, they're like there's like a lot of teeth names like root canal like bitch i need a root canal coma extraction fresh meat sugar cane glucose it's like an interesting mix of like food names and then like things that people have wrong when they have like diabetes there's one called donor like there's an eyeshadow <laughs> like imagine being like is that, is that fucked up to say like a, a fucking like a kidney donor and just seeing that and being like there's like a bright ass white in this palette. Maybe we'll just like start with that. Should I zoom in? Hey. Hey girl. I'm so much uglier. Close up. Okay. Wow, I feel like a beauty guru. Like you're zoomed in, we're in focus, like knock on wood. I'm gonna say fuck the primer because I feel like there is a chance I'm gonna have to take this off. So like why would I prime my eyes for that, you know? Just putting a little bit of glucose. <laughs> In our inner corner. Whoa, I was low-key expecting a brighter white. No Tino shade. It looks like I did nothing. Like literally just nothing. I'm gonna look for a brighter white on one of these palettes. Okay, Jacqueline the Hill. Let's put you to the test. Whose bright white is more pigmented? Yours or Jeffrey's? <gasps> you heard it here first. 
comments, <laughs> six stars. <laughs> oh God, I would be such a fun and fresh beauty guru. All of the comments below were like, obviously her fucking white is more pigmented because you put it over Jeffrey's white. How dare you shade Jeffrey and critically acclaimed Jacqueline. I'm sorry, I'll show that while go. Okay. Fun. Might I say fresh? Now what? If I were a rainbow look, like what color would be my transition color? Yeah, I know what a fucking transition color is. Also, I talked a little bit of shit about Jeffree's palette being the best, but Jacqueline's has a ribbon that like holds them all in, so that's like fun and fresh. It's also very cool that sh her idea was to give you four palettes. I don't know, I travel a lot. Don't really like that one. <laughs> she has a shade called Mugshot. I love that for me. You're gonna make four palettes and you're not gonna put a bright white in any of them or? Oh, wasn't I looking for a transition shade? Ooh, Manny. Manny low key snapped. I really like this palette. Maybe that's just like my the bitch on Bella Thorne like inside of me, but for it to be like half neutral and to have like a nice ass white and a nice ass black and then like hella colors. I'm reviewing this like you give a fuck at all. Like that's not what you came here for. <laughs> like, let's like open Laura Lee's palette. It's so funny how they all have like big ass palettes and hers is just like, maybe it's Maybelline. <laughs> like triangles like it just looks like she just put no offense Laura Lee one time I was supposed to go to one of your product launches and then I didn't I don't know what that has to do with anything I'm just saying but this palette looks like someone made it for you and you just put your name on it and that's okay <laughs> <laughs> like all the other girls in high school me Oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna use it just for, just so I can put her in the thumbnail. Like red, orange, yellow. Okay, so yellow. Yellow is like kind of in the middle of the rainbow. Manny has a good yellow. The name of it is Campy. Why did you name it that? What a stupid name. What does that even mean? Isn't campy like a word you would use to like describe something like gross and bad? Like even like a girl, like that bitch was like campy. Like she needed like a shower. Like, I bet people call me campy. Like I bet somewhere in my Instagram comments, someone right now is calling me campy. Joke's on you, bitch. Yes, I'm pulling my eye tight. Yes, that's gonna give me premature wrinkles. Yes, I'm gonna attempt to fix it with Botox. No, I don't really care. I, my life expectancy also isn't as long as the average person. So if I were to wrinkle before, like I die at 30, like who really cares? Or should I do like that shit that James does where he's like red, like orange, yellow, like green, blue, purple? That. I think I'm gonna throw some blue in this eye right on top of that yellow which makes green I learned that before I dropped out of school I've now decided since there's blue all over my eye I'm not gonna cut my crease just because I don't really know how to go back from here <laughs> I feel like my thing with like eye makeup is like once shit is bad, this is such bad verbiage, but again, I'm not a beauty guru like once shit is bad I just put shit everywhere. Does that make sense? It's kind of like anal <laughs> so then I would go like red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, right? So the closest thing I have to red is in this Jaclyn Hill Vault palette. Kind of a nice little fun and fresh color, but she named it Bomb Ass. And like, don't get me wrong, like I get where she's coming from. Like that's a bomb ass lipstick, like bomb ass. But like it just says bomb ass. <laughs> But it's not even that I have a dirty mind, like bomb ass. Like that's all that says, like you have a bomb ass. Like you have a nice asshole. Like that's where, that's where my mind goes. I don't know, that's just me. Like Jaclyn Hill, I wanna know when you named your red eyeshadow and red, like did you think about how the viewer or the consumer could misconstrue bomb ass as a tight asshole versus like an adjective? Just a thought, just a comment. Just a concern. Okay, but I actually kind of like how this eye is turning out as I'm just like vigorously like beating my eye. <laughs> I'm like, okay, kind of like how this eye is turning out. <laughs> it's like cracked out. I should have used Bella's eyeshadow palettes too. I fucked that up. I fucked that up. Whatever. Maybe for the sequel. Maybe for my next chit chat. Get ready with me since I'm a beauty guru now. Mm, okay, Jeffrey has a color called Prick, which I also think it's very funny that all of these shadows have star imprints in them, but then one just has like a whole ass syringe. <laughs> it's funny because I know Jeffrey. Like, I know he's funny. Like, I know that he knows that that's like a syringe. <laughs> Syringe. Like yeah, like blood sugar, like I get it, like drawing blood syringe, but also like heroin, like just a thought. Just a comment, just a concern. That's, that's like really fun and fresh. Like I might just do that every day to like both eyes. Like it's kind of cute, like imagine with like a wing and like, okay, just a thought, just a comment. Right now at home, did you just say to yourself like, just a concern, <laughs> like are we talking, are we chatting? I'm so annoying in this video. <laughs> This is what happens when you like wake me up before like 6 p.m. And it's 5 p.m. and I just woke this second. <laughs> Manny doesn't have an orange. Maybe our girl Laura Lee's got an orange in this little. Laura Lee coming through with the forecast. Honestly, 
honestly, for my little rainbow look though, her little fucking Party City clearance section palette's gonna do me real well. So I'm gonna get my concealer brush. I'm sorry, I've been waiting so long to be I need like a flat shader brush. Yeah, I know what the fuck a flat shader brush is because I'm a fucking beauty girl. Okay, that's like kind of flat and kind of shadery, okay. She's, wow. Okay, Laura Lee, you know, I really, mm, I don't know if it's good to say good things about her makeup. <laughs> If I say that this eyeshadow is pigmented, am I gonna lose like more subscribers? Like I don't, I don't want to say that then. So like, if it's okay, like it is kind of pigmented. Like, but like if it's not, then it's like totally the least pigmented shadow I've ever used. <laughs> Imagine if I was putting like Jeffrey's white underneath or Manny's white. Manny's white is bomb as fuck. We'll use Jeffrey's though, just because like we've been you know saying some kind of nice things about Laura Lee's shadow, and I don't want to do too many like taboo things in a row. So I feel like if I use Manny's right after you know like saying Laura's shadow. This is literally why I don't make them. Oh my god, I, I almost forgot that I brought tape <laughs> to like make it like, but like I kind of like how it's like rounded and like, yeah, like every day. Update, putting the white underneath it doesn't do fucking anything and it was a complete waste of my time. Is that bad? Is this acceptable? Do you like my makeup? Okay, so now yellow. Laura's yellow is like pissy, but Manny's yellow is like mm -hmm, campy. Get it? Because he named it that for no apparent reason. Does Manny say campy a lot? Is that like, does Manny camp? Does he have like a history of camping? Is there a dual meaning to the word campy? Yo, it's 6 a.m. and I just made that image that you just looked at in Pick Monkey for the last like 45 minutes. Like, I'm not really using a lot of Jaclyn shades, but that's because hers are like significantly more wearable than the rest. And like, obviously, we're not going for like wearable here. And to be real with you, like, opening all these palettes is so inconvenient for me right now. Like, I'm just lazy. <laughs> okay, I'll use her like purple if I remember in two minutes, which I might not because, you know, ADHD. I don't think it looks bad, but it's just so pathetic how like beginner's level makeup this is. Like I really was hoping for like something that was like, oh wow, like Tana could do that. But like clearly I fucking can't because I'm a boy with a giant ass dick, so. Is that good? Should I go live on Instagram? Like should I ask people if that's good? Like I really don't know. Back in with Jacqueline's red shade that's still named Bomb Ass. Like who at Morphe was like, yeah, no, like good shade name. Oh, but I, I guess they probably just let them like pick whatever fucking shade names they want because of like the copious amounts of racks they're about to like make them. Okay, but now I feel like the orange got like lost. Laura Lee, where are you? And I love that this palette is called Party Animal. Like please imagine Laura Lee like really being like a party animal. Like imagine Laura Lee like on a party bus like doing coke off of a stripper's like asshole. Like you can't. Like why did you name your palette that? Like you should have named it like Country Bumpkin. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. I don't know if it's good or bad, so I'm just gonna move on. So now I guess I would go red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. I started with the red. I could start with the purple again, but I just like don't want to. I don't really like purple, so. Okay, so we have Laura Lee's like pissy green. Manny has like a turquoise green called Kiki, which I, I'm curious to know if he did before Drake or not. Honestly, the prettiest green so far in Jaclyn Hill's original palette. I might use those. I would never use this one. I really like the Vault series, like the, the orangey palette's really Really cool, but this literally just looks like the character from The Shape of Water, like threw up. I guess it's like jewel tones though. Like I don't really know shit, so. <laughs> We're gonna mix Laura Lee's like pissy green. Oh my God, I didn't even look at her names. Oh boy, oh boy. This one is named Issa Party. Like I-S-S-A, like Issa Party, Issa Party. Like, like on some hood shit. Dranks. This one is named Dranks. Like with an A. <laughs> like pour up that drink. Like double cup of drink. Like lean. Like I'm seizing. <laughs> like, imagine Laura Lee like pouring up a double cup of lean and like sipping her drink. Pull up. Drink. Drink. Headshot. Drink. Drink. Sit down. Bottoms up, damage control. That's so ironic that one of her, I'm sorry. Like I made a lot of mistakes and I filmed a lot of apologies and I'm in no place to make fun of anyone else because I'm sure I'll have to apologize for like this video tomorrow. But like she named a shade damage control. That's so funny. Hung over. Like I want a public statement from Laura Lee or Morphe telling me who 
named these shades. <laughs> like, even if she didn't name them, she was like, yeah, no, like, that orange shade should definitely be called drank. Like, I guess she's from Texas, Houston, lean, but, like, Laura Lee still wasn't leaning in Houston with, like, thugs. Like, let's just... I'm gonna use the shade called Issa Party. Like, Laura Lee has never said Issa in her entire life. Like, she'd be like, y'all, like, we're having a pull down, throw down. And I'm not trying to be, like, offensive. I'm not saying people in Texas don't party. I'm saying Laura Lee. <laughs> Okay, I actually kind of like this green for this like look though, just in the sense of how it's kind of like yellowy, so it kind of like, like, oh shit, it went from yellow to green, like, no? Okay. No. <laughs> okay, so now I guess I'm gonna like put on some blue. I'm not really happy with the green, but I don't think any of these palettes have like the right green for like my look, you know? Manny's palette's also very pretty. Like that is kind of fun and fresh. I should have tried this look, imagine, imagine. But there's no fucking way he created that one. He was just like low key using like Jeffrey's eyeshadows to like make this look. <laughs> really sorry that I continue to hone in on the shade names. Like, really. Like, seriously, I'm very, very, very sorry. But this one is named Sickening. And, like, again, like, I'm an illiterate bitch. I dropped out of high school. But, like, it is absolutely, without a doubt, for a fact, spelled wrong. Like, Sickening has an E. Do you think that's because of, like, copyright issues? But, but also, if someone told me I couldn't have a shade name because of copyright, I wouldn't just spell it wrong and put it in... I'm gonna go back in with uh, Kiki, mixing it with Issa Party. <laughs> and now, this is why people don't take YouTubers seriously. Like, poor James Charles. Like, he just wants to be taken seriously and release, like, a Sherry Ashishar palette. But Laura Lee's out here naming shades, like, karaoke and bottoms up. <laughs> That's insane. Man, he's out here, like, spelling his shit wrong. I love people. I'm not... If I had an eyeshadow palette, it would literally be my own human fecal matter, like, spread across pans. Like, I'm not saying I can do it right, okay? I'm just observing. Okay, now I'm gonna fuck up some blue. I'm using Manny shade called Fishy. I get it, like, fish, water, but also pussy, just me? Okay. It could be better, uh, but it could also be worse. Ooh, Jeffree Star has a great purple. <laughs> named Root Canal, and that I didn't even notice this until right now. I don't know what symbol this is, and I don't want to have a scandal for not knowing. I want to say it's like on some Red Cross shit, but this one's just named Coma. <laughs> Fun fact, when I got dental work done, I got dental work done on my top 10 teeth, and six out of the 10 needed Root Canals, like right then and there, because like I never went to the dentist as a child, which is absolutely insane. Growing up, my dad would just like take me to random dentists, and like, I would go to the dentist and get like, I'd go get the first part of a root canal. And then like the dentist would be like, okay, well she's gonna have to come back like next week to get the other half of the root canal. Like you'll just pay us and you'll come back or whatever. And then my dad wouldn't pay that dentist and then they wouldn't see me again. And then he would just take me to a new dentist and be like, I don't know, like fix it. And like, we did this until I was like banned from like 10 dentists in like Vegas because like my dad wouldn't pay them. And like, that's why this tooth is missing. Cause I never got the second half of the root canal. Story time. <laughs> God, my childhood was so good and fresh and fun. <laughs> I mean, that definitely just looks like I got like decked in the eye right there. Jeffrey's shadows, in my opinion, though, are by far the most like buildable, best texture, like the least amount of fallout, transfers to the eye well, blends well, but like when you blend it, it doesn't like go away, if that makes sense. I don't know why I'm reviewing this. You don't care. Ooh, but the outside of this eye look looks significantly worse than the outside of this eye look. Like that's like passable. That's like not. <laughs> This one is so like normal and like borderline wearable and then this one just looks like I took a kid's eyeshadow palette and like just like wearing Whoa! Like this side is fine, yeah. but this is so wrong. No, it's blended a little. <laughs> like a lot. Yeah. The other? The other is good and fresh and fun, right? I was just saying that. Yeah. And then this one's like shape of water, like swamp meat got punched in the eye. Oh. <laughs> 
Mario, what's your toy to the tweet? Oh my god, I literally hate Mario Salmon. Mario Salmon, if you're watching this, I literally fucking hate you. Like, I just want to let you guys know, Mario's one of my best friends, and he's one of the funniest people I've ever met, and I mean that. Like, I don't, I don't like to tell people that they're funny or think people are funny unless they're, like, basically my taste is, like, really good, and, like, if I think you're funny, like, you're funny. And he's so funny, and he doesn't show it to his fans, and he just, like, wants to be this PG little mess. But then he's, like, the least PG, like, most funny person ever, and anytime I post anything of him that's actually funny, he's like, can you delete it? It's too much. Like, fuck you. Just a thought. Think about it like this. From here, is it that bad? <laughs> Top comment is just like, yes, with like 5,000 thumbs up. I go back on my blood. I get it now. It's not like blood and sugar. It's like blood sugar, like my blood sugar's low. Oh, fuck, I'm so stupid. <laughs> I'm out here like, why is one name like glucose and one name like coma? Like it's it's all like, so is this just like Loki a diabetes theme palette? Does Jeffree sort of diabetes? I don't know. Am I being insensitive? So many hurdles today that we're having to cross. Now I kind of want to add like some bright ass shimmery ass white like right to the inner corner. I really like Jaclyn Hill's shimmery white like in this palette, it's bomb. Again, you don't give a shit, but I'm just gonna keep telling you. And I guess I'll just add it up here like while we're here. Ooh, shit, okay. Like yeah, like it's like a look. Like you put like white underneath my eyebrow. Dude, like I could literally just like splatter paint on my eye, but if there's like white under my eyebrow, like that means I tried, right? I'm not mad. Like, why do I think it's good? Like, why am I getting, like, cocky? <laughs> I also have Jeffree's 24 karat highlight palette, which is the only thing 24 karat I'm ever gonna own. I never, ever wear highlight. Like, I'm just not really a highlight gal. Like, I only ever have on highlight if, like, a makeup artist puts it on me, because it's just... I don't ever know, like, what's, like, good or, like, fresh or, like, fun, you know? Oh. Like, that, I, like, I just did that so wrong. <laughs> why do I like it? <laughs> I'm talking in like this font. Why do I like it? You know, I have some of yesterday's lashes. I'm gonna glue them on. Okay, wait, while the eyelash glue is drying, I went downstairs and I got Bella's palette solely because I wanna put her face in the thumbnail so that this can get more views. No, I'm kidding. Um, but <laughs> she also has like two fire ass reds. Red is her favorite color in these palettes. And I felt like the reds I was using were definitely more, um, I'm out of breath from going up and down the stairs. So fun and fresh. I was totally planning on keeping this look like primarily matte. However, I'm totally not biased at all. These totally aren't like my girlfriend's eyeshadow palettes and I totally like, you know, I think all of the ones I use are good, but like this one's just like totally the best and I'm just not biased at all. Uh, hers is just by far the best. This eye's so bad. <laughs> Shout out Bella, thank you for giving me your palettes and letting me sell out to them. No, but really, if I could link any palette below and tell you to get them, it's definitely my girlfriend's. She's pigmented, she's creamy. Like, okay, Bella, like, okay, curate your own eyeshadow palettes, go off. Hey. <laughs> so I put lashes on. You can leave your honest thoughts, comments, and concerns in the comments below. I don't know how to feel. Like, I know this isn't good. Oh my God, this entire video, I've had nothing to promote and no code, and like, I'm using all of these products, and like, I'm just like, you know, like, use code James, whatever. Literally, use code Tana for Lily Lashes Miami, the only thing good about this look. <laughs> I know I'm not a beauty guru. I know I'm not a makeup artist. I know that the average person could do better, but I think that for me, like the fact that I'm even debating on like wearing this right now to like the shit I have to go do is so fun and fresh. I definitely wanted to do something crazier. You know, I just, I really ended up with something so wearable and every day, but. But also what if I just talk to people like this all day? Like I'm just like, yeah, it could work. I feel like I should FaceTime someone and ask them what they think. Who would be like honest with me? Maybe Trevor? talking shit about you in my video. I didn't think you guys would be together. Mario's with Trevor, you guys. <laughs> you're a piece of shit. No, Tim, you're a piece of shit. You just suck, but I'm also calling about my makeup. No, I know, but the fact that you're, like, answering to Trevor when I'm literally texting you multiple times. I'm busy do you, doing this makeup look. Wait, is it called, is it, is it gonna be called, like, full face of makeup by YouTubers you hate or some shit? No, it's good. Okay, this wasn't what I wanted. I have to go. I think I'm gonna ask Hunter because if you don't have a boyfriend, just get yourself a Hunter. It's like the next best thing, you know? Well, this is embarrassing. Okay, I need you to tell me if my makeup is good or bad. Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> That's a lot. Um, 
No, yeah, it's cool. But is it good or bad? It's new. It's fun and fresh. Like if I just showed up to hang out like this, like would you like it? No. <laughs> they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Imagine you showing up to hang out with me like that. Do you like girls that make up like this? Mm-hmm. Okay. The lips are kind of throwing me off. Okay, wait. It's way more calm without the lips. And then just like <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that's all I needed. You wanna say hi? Yeah. <laughs> okay guys, sound off in the comments below. <laughs> if you're a makeup artist, I would love to hear your reaction to this. Like not really the like tea aspect, like yeah, like that's like fun and fresh and like we did that for the views and like cool. But like if you're a makeup artist at home, tell me what I did wrong, tell me what I can do better, other than like pulling my eye, like yeah, I know that's wrong, like I can't stop. <laughs> other than that, let me know. So that's it for today's video, you guys. My lip color, by the way, if you care, is these new like glossy NARS things called Red District. That's like a normal name. That's why there is. I was gonna say succeeding brand. That was so mean. Jeffrey is succeeding. Jacqueline's kind of succeeding. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that's it, you guys, for a full face of people. I don't know, full face of YouTubers you might hate. Every single person with a palette that I use in this video is controversial. Like Jeffrey, Bella, me. I'm the most controversial. Now I have them all right here on my face. All right guys, uh, I'll see you in my next video. It's probably gonna be an apology for this video. So just uh, turn your notifications on. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this Sister Stellar rainbow look and I will talk to you guys in the next video. If you live in the Dominican Republic, I will be coming to you very, very, very soon for the SOS Music Festival. So if you guys want to see me perform these song lyrics. <laughs> it's so funny because Jordan just texted me and was like, hey, can you tell Tana to promote DR like right now? Yeah, that's right. Beach. I just thought my tongue was blue and then I just did that. Oh, that's so unfortunate. When your Juvederm is too full, so you just get lipstick all over your face. Your lipstick is really smeared on the side. I mean, it's for the thumbnail. I could just like facetune it. It's so funny because I knew about this palette before it released because Manny and Jeffrey were fighting and I was with Jeffrey. Is this too much tea for this YouTube video? And Manny like came at Jeffrey on Twitter and Jeffrey was like, well, I know his palette name and I know he doesn't want to like get that leaked and he literally just tweeted him back like, life's a drag, winky emoji. Like, imagine being that much of a savage. My vault got vilked. <laughs> Laura's like, Morphe kicked me out. Like I'm not meaning to be mean. It's just so funny. I have to tell you the funniest thing by the way the names of these shades It's a party like I S S A Like imagine Laura Lee being like what a like it's a party, you know, like it's Laura Lee bitch like damage control <laughs> Dranks but like dranks like with an A but, Like imagine if Laura Lee like powered up with a double cup with my drank like leaning <laughs> Literally what? And then bottoms up, hungover, and karaoke. This just sounds like her life after the controversy.